Hello, this is Clicking Gaming, and welcome back to To The Moon. We last left off, we rode some horses, and then it turns out that this guy, old dude's kind of a dick, and there's still more story, so, uh, who knows? And let us continue going back in time slash forward, all that stuff. Well, to be fair, a ticking clock is pretty annoying indeed. Boosh. Let's see, walking around, ooh, room. Books. Various books with smudge titles. I bet it's the Animorphs. Yes. Ooh, look, and there's the pickled olives. Ugh, blood, not again. Glass of pickled cucumbers. <gasps> Plot twist! <laughs> Holy crap, my mind's totally blown. <laughs> oh my god. You're pretty easily impressed. A boosh. Well, let's go into this other room now. Boosh. There's a soccer ball. Oh, and found the momentum. There we go. A dusty pile of animal books sit here. Oh, found them. Can I go outside? Nope. Wait. Yep. Nope. Nope. Can I... What to go... Where to do? What else is there to look at? Yeah. I'm just like one away, but what is it I also need? Wait, I have to fiddle with the couch. Oh, there we go. Hmm, that was... Well, this little section was lacking in storage, I think. Ugh! 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 Yes! Let us prepare. Computer read text to continue the story. And we gotta find this in six moves. Hmm. Six moves. Hmm. Okay. I'm gonna figure this out. Somehow. Oh. One. All right. Two. Three. Four. Five. And behold, six. Ugh, I did it. Yes. Write it down upon me. Ugh. Now let's go. Then go back to the past. Whoa! That was a little delay there, though. Nope, we're trapped in a spectral plane of nothing, apparently. Ugh, it smells like roadkill again. Where are we? Eva? <laughs> what the hell is that? Is it like a monster? Oh my god, it's it's ever doom doom and darkness and stuff. Every great googly moogly, everything's gone to shit. That's his next memory. Yeah, but why is it going la Laputa on us? I don't know, we're just not linking the memories together for construction. There must be a malfunction with the machine's A ADG. Again? I thought the last fix was foolproof for, foolproof for another half half a year. Blah, I've got skull and crossbones. Can't believe those idiots in the maintenance department. Look, don't worry, we've already gotten the teenage years saved. Might still be able to do this. <laughs> Ugh. Alright, but I ain't telling him about this. As long as we succeed, he doesn't have to know. Well, I guess this is it. There's nothing we can do here. Ready to finalize for activation? Ladies first. Huh. <laughs> Deep to the abyss of the unknown. What a shame. I was actually looking forward to it. 
Who am I? Now I fail out of existence. Out of the mind of one man. And back to reality. Oh, nope. Act 2. Billions of lighthouses stuck at the far end of the sky. I mean, you know that, yeah, there was an Act 1 now that I think about it. I completely forgot. Don't disturb them. God damn it. We're all alone with nothing to do. They might not wake easily, but they need the con concentration. Oh, no, that, that's it. Oh, now we're back here. When I said exit, I mean return back to this part of the game. And that's all this old fool knows. <laughs> so I can't be with more help. Then that'll have to be enough. Aye, right, all that's left to do is link your rich to desire to go to the moon to your early memories. Then we'll pull the switch and voila, you'll be on the moon in no time. I have a question. If you can make Lily disappear, that means you can alter this world. Then, can you not simply make things happen and fulfill my wish here and now? That would work if this were one of your true set of memories. What do you mean? What is this then? What am I? This is just a copy. A canvas for us to work with, if you will. As for you, you are merely an al algorithm traced from Johnny. Uh, not to reflect his likeness, but far from complete. All we can do is prepare this canvas in a logically consistent way. And then, when we transfer your registered desire to your childhood, the machine will generate your new life and one word of the desire dictates your behavior. The result of that would then be written to the real John. So, you see, even if we satisfy you, you are merely a RAID-only program. I mean, we could reset you over and over again, and, uh, that's enough. Oh, don't be so sensitive. He's not real, you know. Like, oh, we're gonna hurt his feelings, just even though he's still not real. Oh my god. If you truly believe that, why did you e even care to explain? Touché. I'm just trying to save time. Let's go. Huh. Blah. Huh. Huh. Doctor. Blah, blah, blah. Is that what I truly am? Heh <laughs> eh. I don't know. <laughs> Whoa! Back to fading and disappearing, going through different loops in the timeline and stuff. What about Cumbrella, the bunny, the flowers, the platypus? Uh, all of an, our night's work. Yep, all the, the various items that we have collected. The platypuses, the books, random bunnies. There's that clock from earlier. More platypuses and stuff. And then the Forbidden Zone over there. We don't talk about it, though. Oh, but now I'm a fish, apparently. What the? At least give me a warning first. What can I say? I like being ahead. Ooh. I'd ask if that was a pun, but I'm afraid you'd say yes. Heh. <laughs> now we're both fish. Let's do this fast. I feel silly in this form as it is. All we need to do is pass this desire from the latest memory to the earliest. Okay. Uh. Line up two matching mementos on the edge to transfer the rich to desire. Okay, so we want to get the flowers to match. There we go. Next, we probably want to get the platypus. This is like a puzzle game, yeah. Let's see, so we probably want to get this... something along this line connected. Oh, I see what I have to do. I have to connect that... the bunny... And I have to connect this, like that. Ooh, we're fishes, swimming through the vast sea of memories. 
Okay. And... <laughs> hey, check this out. <laughs> Seriously? You're doing this now? In the middle of this game? Let's see. I actually don't even have a mentor I can connect to right now. I don't think I do. Oh, wait, no, the book. Damn it. This feels like a lot of retracing my steps to get this to work out. Wait a minute, but now that doesn't work out, because how can I connect this stuff then? I feel like I'm a little bit stuck between a rock and an hour place here. Because I can't connect this memory if that's not on the bottom. But I can't because I need to get the books to connect together. Oh, 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 I think I'm digging a little too deep here. I have to transfer, like, each memory to each other in a way. So I don't have to have them all interconnected, I guess. Alright, then we need the clock to connect, I guess. Alright, there we go. I thought they all had to be interconnected, which would have really screwed me over there. Oh, yep. <laughs> Ding, that's about all the ones we could work with. Ready to pull the switch? You know me, always ready. It's all miss being in a fish form. You know, I see that thing right over there. Oh, can't look at it. Huh. Alright, let's go check what souvenirs he brought back from the moon. Ladies first. Not this time, hun. What was this? Too bad we got a straggler here. No loss, we can do this without him. I know, but uh, it feels incomplete. You get too attached, it's going to be impede your ability to do your job. That's rubbish, they'll pin your womanly ways on me. God damn it. Alright, let's go check it out. Let's see what he brought back on the moon. Am I supposed to look at a certain thing? Look, old dude here. <laughs> this is the same city as this real last accessible memory. Usually there's at least some change. Something isn't right. These memories, they feel more than just having happened again. They were exactly the same. That's impossible. The desire was transferred, was it not? It was. But obviously he must have fucked up or something. Missouri. Let's go to that place, probably. <laughs> Uh-oh. Yep, it's exactly the same. We dang goofed. We goofed. Johnny? Huh. What a pleasant surprise. We don't get many visitors around here. Deja vu. Again. My name is Dr. Eva Rosalie, and this is... What? I'm not saying it twice. Screw it. Dr. Neil Watts. Are you familiar with the Signet Agency of Life Generation? Oh, are you two from the agency? <laughs> Uh-oh. How come you I've just been thinking about calling you? Liv, go some tea, please. <laughs> oh, Lily. <laughs> oh, sweet sassy molassy. Freeze him, too. Yeah, okay. Well. Wait here, I'll go send the desire signal again. See if there's any changes. Uh, I gotta get stuck with the boring job just sitting here and waiting. It transferred successfully for sure. Any changes? Not even a hair. Of course, his mustache does look a little bit bushier, in my opinion. How could this be, even if his desire doesn't work alone? Why is there no change at all? Perhaps, perhaps it just needs some provoking to activate. From his early memories? The earliest we can get to. Let's go. <laughs> Ugh. Oh no, I still have to wait, okay. Hooah. 
Giants decided to go then we might need some stimulation to be brought up, huh? Well then <laughs> Whoa whoa that <laughs> moon <laughs> Wait wait a minute. What the this wasn't here This isn't what they said they was playing. Oh well. Do you mind River? No, I like this one. <laughs> Alright, let's go then. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Alright. Hopefully that's enough for ignition. Wait, where is Neil? Is he in the corner? Is he over here? <laughs> Did you see to the moon? How was it? Eh, it was a bit too much pretense for me. I prefer my moves a bit more, oh, je ne sais quoi. <laughs> Shut up, that movie was great! It's also a terrible game! Maybe he's watching the film. Well, let's see what's unfolding over here. Head to the moon, darling! Uh, oh, Henry! Dear Lord, I'm way too tired and hungry to be constructing movies. Guess I should go see if anything's changed with John. Sorry for making you sit through this, buddy. Let's skip ahead here. Heh, <laughs> now we're back to our old days. It's all the same. I'll have to try ignite and get somewhere else then. This is ridiculous. <laughs> Screw this, I am out. I need Trevor's through John to try somewhere else. Oh, I actually, actually go inside of him? I must go inside him. Huh, look, will we? <laughs> Hold on, I'm just digging through your brain. Perhaps something here could work. I don't have any time for her right mm. now. <laughs> so you just threw another encyclopedia in your place, huh? Did she? Shut up, dude. What are you guys? What are you guys doing here? It's starting. Let's go get a good spot. Wait, I don't remember that happening. Something must have changed. <laughs> hey, don't squeeze. Let's see what's going down. Is a fight about to go down? Wait a minute. This isn't a real change. This is... <laughs> May I have your attention, please? Oh my god. As you know, I'm a representative sent from NASA in all of its glory. And I'm here to tell you all about it. Oh my god, are you serious? Hit it, Timmy! Wow, that was terrible. But I digress. Anyway, I know that many of you are wondering... <laughs> what chances do I have to do something as awesome as venturing in another realm? To inhale the sweetness of Venus? To swim counterclockwise through the rings of Saturn? Or perhaps just chilling at the backs of the moon? Well, here at NASA, we believe that with enough will, everyone has the potential. It could be you! Or you! Or perhaps. You! But I don't want to go to the moon. Then you're in. Wait, what? Why not? Why should I? I'm happy here on Earth as it is. Well, don't you want to. Go there even a little bit? <laughs> no, why? Not even a tiny bit? Um, no? Hmm. <laughs> uh, what? Stop staring at me. Well, as an official NASA recruiter, I shall go over some facts about the moon. <laughs> oh my god. To start all, the moon was 4.5 billion years old. And did you know that it's a surface about as big as Africa? It's true. In fact, if you try to bike over the, around the moon, blah 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 blah, he's just slowly moving closer to the. And also, it takes 
1.5247 seconds for the light to travel to the moon from here. And if you drive a flying car, it takes 130 days. <laughs> I knew that! No, you didn't! Shut up! And last but not least, people who go to the moon get rich and famous. And we all know that rich plus famous equals groupies. So, uh, that includes my presentation. Uh, remember, NASA welcomes any of you, especially if you're a brunette. I'm looking at you, dude. <laughs> no, not you, no, 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 the, the guy who is actually in color. <laughs> well, what do you think? NASA probably wouldn't hire you, but I suppose it was a plain enough for this. Hmm, I do try pretty hard. Are you gonna just go see if that worked? Of course, it'd be right back. Hoo And I'm back. <laughs> yep. Report. Utter failure. Deuce. Hey, don't get discouraged. I'm sure there are still things to be done. Such as? Well, hmm. Uh, uh, um, um, uh, um, still thinking. We can't afford to finish building this house, Isabel. We can barely afford to pay for a treatment. <laughs> but I can afford the Lunar Triple Lottery! <laughs> oh my god. If you sell this house, you sure can! Is the diagnosis certain? Yes, in fact, we really have anyone. Did you know that NASA has excellent healthcare plans? It's true for both of you and your spouse! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Go to the fucking moon! Vapor rides in space! Oh look, a wedding! Good for you! But here's a riddle! Guess where you can go for the honeymoon? God, I hate my life right now. That river? <laughs> that moon! Ah, oh, damn it, you're not in here. <laughs> Dig, nabbit, glass, slivery. Johnny, John, John! <laughs> oh my god! What the cucumber? Did you really think jumping into the window was a good idea? Uh, no, he wasn't here. Whew. You know what? This is just isn't working. It's more than just not working, it's ridiculous. We're freaking professors, I didn't sign up for a job to run around yelling at him like an idiot. Seriously, did you see some of those things I said? Yeah, that honeymoon pun was like really bad. Shut up, it's the best I can do! You didn't? Look, maybe this lack of sleep's getting to us. Had I known we'd be on an all letter, I would have brought coffee. I agree, you should have seen this. Seen the movie I constructed earlier. <laughs> what movie? Exactly. Anyway, as valuable as our time is here, this just isn't going anywhere like this. Let's take a break till morning. Hopefully Johnny can hang on till then. I do have some calls to make. Yep, everything is gone poorly. Does it make sense? Why did the machine have no effect? Johnny's registered wish to go to the moon was successfully transferred yet. There wasn't even a trace of him wanting to go to the moon after the transfer. Unless, unless the secondary condition for the desire was changed in the process. Only then would the same desire produce two different outcomes at two different points in time. There's no denying that River played an important role through it all. If there's anything that could have caused the core to change, he would be, be the top suspect. But of all things, what exactly caused it? River. Just what exactly did you do? I don't know. But I'm assuming we're gonna find out at some point. Ah, uh, the sun's rising. Ooh, look, seagulls. Yep, 
the gulls of the sea. What horrible creatures. We don't have much time left. I wonder if Neil came up with anything. Well, let's go slowly walk over there. Because, you know, we're not in a rush or anything. Oh, man. Ugh, you can smell that squirrel Neil ran over all the way here from now. It just, uh, this game is just so good. I, I love this. How is John doing? Barely hanging on. What are you two doing? We just, we just couldn't make any progress. You better be soon. We don't have them long. By God. If you think you're looking for your colleague, I think he's in the kitchen. Oh, so I just walked upstairs for nothing. Damn it. This, this, this is this the kitchen? Yep. No, I understand that part, but... Okay, did you confirm it in his records? And why again was this information not made available to us? Or the medical doctor, for that matter. Where did you get that coffee? Shh. I'm talking on the phone. Are you speaking with headquarters? Yes, I'll fulfill you in later. After, blah, blah, blah. Now shush. Wait, isn't this... Where did you find it? In the lighthouse before we started. Now, for the last time, shush. What's this shiny thing on the ground? Oh. Turns on the lamp. Am I annoying you yet? Am I annoying you? Are you annoying you? God, stop acting like me! Doesn't expect this more. That's part of gave to John. I guess I'll just go to the lighthouse then, I guess. That probably seems the possible choice. To the lighthouse, away! Better go see if Neil has any ideas. Oh my god, I just talked to Neil and he complained a lot. Well, it's apparently I still have to talk to Neil, even though he apparently doesn't seem to know anything. <sighs> right, that part we can do. I'm not sure, we'll have to check on that. Right, that part we can do. But what if... Okay, I suppose so. Right, that part we can do. I'm not even clicking it now. I'm like literally clicking off screen now, actually. Now just tell me other stuff. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. That's not even a thing. I didn't even click on it. I was clicking on the cupboard. Check out other stuff. Let's check out this piano. Four River. What kind of song is this? It's just two notes repeated over and over. I just like walking around. I have no clue what to do. Oh. But Ma, I don't want to go to school. It's Sunday, dear. Shh, let them sleep. I was walk around a little, check out things. Let's look at this book. Is it the Animorphs? I bet it's the Animorphs, isn't it? Facebook on stand. What is this? Why can't I look at this? Just like the tale of a crew who fell in love with a zombie who made the smell of daisies when showered with gentle sunlight. Ugh, maybe another year. The Pilgrim Guide to Origami. The Pilgrim Guide to Origami has already supplanted the great Wikipedia Origami as the standard representative of all knowledge and wisdom about people folding, for though it has many omissions, it contains much of its apocryphal or at least widely inaccurate scores over the older, more pedestrian work in the two more important respects. <gasps> First, it is made of paper, and secondly, it provides numerous band-aids to make up for the inevitable paper cuts resulting in the reading of this book. Need more? Sure, why not? For the grand origami master, it is absolutely essential for each origami to be complete 
pleated in exactly 42 moves. In most origami tournaments, scissor cuts are considered cheating, but uppercuts are deemed legal. That was completely pointless. And what's this, this weird thing up in the up in the foreground? Are they sleeping? Well, I'm out of ideas. I want to talk to you. Stop walking away from me, damn it. Those two shouldn't have stayed up that late, but I should have watched them. Well, it's not everyday circumstances. I know, but I'm just so exhausted. I'm sure you're even more so. I really need to take a seat. If there's anything you want to ask, let me sit down first. Oh, was there something you wanted to ask? Uh, yeah, that's why I kind of stopped you like five seconds ago. Huh? Tell me more about you. You know, it's pretty unusual for someone like you to work here. With two children and all, I mean. It's not that bad, really. There's a school bus that passes through here. But how did you even end up here? Well, a few years ago, my husband passed away. What happened? He was in the army. They were the last batch to be deployed overseas. Sorry to hear. I panicked. Our savings were low and the job market was grim. Johnny saw my ad and offered me this job. I accepted with gratitude. This place was peaceful, too. It helped me with my grieving. Doesn't the, doesn't the government issue grants to war widows to help get them back on their feet? They do, and eventually I received aid. But by then, Johnny was starting to have trouble on his own. He needed my help. Tommy and Sarah liked this place too, and so he stayed. As for Johnny, he was glad as well. You're going to miss him. I think deep down he really wanted a family. Uh, oh, is this it? Let's see. How about Tommy and Sarah? So what are you going to tell them about John? I... I don't know. I'll probably make something up, but it's no use. Kids are smart nowadays. They'll figure it out. Might as well. It's the nature of life. There's nothing to hide. And now the future. This is your full-time job, isn't it? What do you do when this is over? What else is there to do? Find a job in the city and live on, I suppose. It's a shame, though. I'm going to miss Johnny in this place. We all come back to visit every once in a while. And no more questions. I'm done. Oh, hey. Here's this thing you need to advance the plot of the story. Oh, thanks! For Johnny fell conscious, he told me that you two would probably be coming soon. He said he probably wouldn't get the chance himself, but... He wanted me to tell you thanks for him. So, thank you. Well, now I'm sad, because we didn't do what we were supposed to. Okay, let's go into this room, then. So there are probably a couple rooms left. Anything good in here? Um... Fill the sink. Nope. That was pointless. How about we go in here? Or was I already in here? Yeah, I was already in here. We're going down to the basement. Basement of Diddly Doom. Oh, but the rabbits, rabbits. What's this? A broken music box. Oh, I bet that's music box that sings about how everything's alright, even though it's not. Anything good over here? The cabinet's full of unused fine china. That one's full of books. Probably the Animorphs. What's this? Chest is locked. Of course it is. Well, I kind of explored everything I can really could have pretty much basically explored. And examine the clock again. Maybe it'll reveal all its secrets to me. Hmm. Okay, Neil, are you done yet? Hmm. What is it? It seems like our little Johnny here has some hidden records from the old days. Hidden records? Hidden medical records, to be exact. Oh. Apparently, during his youth, he was administered a large dose of enhanced beta blockers. And with luck, they tend to have this little side effect of a curious thing called memories. Beta blockers. Johnny didn't have a heart condition, did he? Apparently not. Which leads one to wonder if the side effects were intended to be merely just that to begin with. And in such a large amount. His impact on his memories at the time of administration must have been significant. 
You think that's why he kept us out of his earliest memories? Well, it's not like the machine, I'll tell you that. The maintenance department yelled at me for scolding them. So, what now? I was just given the reconfiguration frequencies. That should get us past the blockers. And once we're in this challenge, it might finally be early enough to transfer his desire for it to work. Then what were we waiting for? But just one thing. Of course, there's always what the one thing. In order to activate the new frequencies, we'll need a trigger. A trigger? Something that exists strongly in the bridging and inex inex inaccessible memories, and we'll need to give it to John for him to stimulate his memory eternally. But what do you know of that? We've only got a glimpse of his childhood memories. And even if you find a childhood photo or something, John's unconscious. Yeah, back to square one. Maybe that platypus? Or something? No, this job hasn't been such a pain in the ores as for me since Nora's case last year. Likewise. This is killing me. I'm going to get some fresh air. Huh. <clears throat> I forgot my coffee. Okay, now I'm leaving. See you later, bitch. Hey, no, better blocker. Alright, let's go. <laughs> it smells! Quit barging in and out of doors. Make up your mind where you want to go. The road killer, it smells. I know, it's your fault for running over it. What's going on? The children are still sleeping. Wait a minute. That last memory, the one we were stuck at. It was the same smell. What are you two talking about? The old factory receptors are directly linked to the brain, the brain's limbic system, Lily. Don't you see what this means? I'm... What? Huh? I don't know. He means that the smell is arguably the most effective smell for memory recall. We could just use it as a stimulant to bring Bridget's childhood memories. And the best part, even though Johnny's unconscious, he's still so the he can still smell it, basically. I, I think I'm missing some vital contextual info on this whole thing. Like, Alright, this is good. This is awesome. No, like, seriously, I've been lost. Can you just... Now, you just need to fetch the speed of the roadkill. Yes, I'll just... Wait, why should I fetch it? You're the one who ran over it. Exactly, I've already done my part. Oh, you miserable bastard. Um, if it helps any, I, uh... <laughs> I have a pair of gloves you can borrow. <laughs> Doom! This is where it turns into a horror game. They're really disposable gloves, but that'll all change after this. Oh my god, can you pick up a pace? Oh my god, we're trying to give this man a dream to go to the moon, and you're still walking at a snail's pace. Can I run fast? No, nope, we're still walking. Uh, huh, deja vu. <sighs> oh man, this is taking forever. For the love of God, don't make me walk all the way back. And no roadkill. The kind of things this job gets me into. It's not such just bringing a piece of German infected roadkill like this. There's a valve container in the car to at least make it the order control. Okay. Oh, wait, no, I have to go all the way back because he has the keys. Oh, thank God, I don't have to go all the way back to get the stupid keys. Oh, thank God, I don't have to wait either. <laughs> doom doom. Where are you going? I... I need to go drink my coffee. I gotta go take a leak. But there's a bathroom, like, right there. No time, I have to go to a tree. What makes the crash shook everything up? Let's see. Ah, here it is. We see it's valve container. What the heck was this weird bottle thing? Now don't get some of that dirty rock kill. What the heck is this? This. Painkillers? Oh, Neil probably been doing a ton of drugs. 
What a surprise. Ugh. We didn't contain road kill order. I don't want anything more to do with this. No, we didn't get a piece of the road kill. We just got a piece of its odor. Oh my god, we actually have to slowly walk our way back all the way there, too. Uh, slowly but surely, I'll get there. Oh, look, there you are, Neil. Huh, oh, hey. Did you get the road kill? It's ready. Uh, great, go get it set up. I'll be right back. Neil? Uh, uh, what is it? These pinkos, I think they're yours. Hey! May I ask why you are on them? I have a drug problem? I wasn't going to tell you, but... Oh, this is embarrassing. A few days ago, I walked into a concrete wall. You just walked into a wall like that? What can I say? I was in deep thought. You know how deeply I think. These are some rather strong pills, Neil. And it was rather strong concrete wall. What's your point? It was a match made in heaven, I say. Anyways, you got the roquel, right? Let's hurry. John's dying back there. Neil? You aren't addicted, are you? Are you kidding me? I'd overdose before I'd sink to that level of contrived mess. Yeah. Yeah, you totally would. Doo doom. Doo doom. So when we get back into the exact point, I will send the signal. When I do, I want you to release the valve for about three seconds. Certainly. Ugh. About time you showed up. Have you made sure the gems are sealed off? Fully sealed and filtered. Not like it matter to a dead man. Did you know that Johnny's condition is deteriorating fast? This might be your last chance, you two. Whatever you do in there, good luck. Godspeed. Luck's the last thing we need. Experience is something we definitely need more. <laughs> Ooh, and we're Link. Ah, oh, flying through space and stuff, blah blah blah, you know, the usual stuff. Act 3. They shine their lights at the leather lighthouses and at me. It was pretty blinding. Holy crap. I am speeding through these now. But, um... Oh. And now we're back to the past. Let's go. Oh, and we have everything. So anyway, I think I'm going to end the video here for now. And anyway, if you enjoyed the video, like and subscribe. Or don't, you don't have to. And I will see you all in the next video.